our shores rarely manifested seemingly indomitable forces. But in the beginning of December 1989, Malta experienced the harshest weather that we could recall for years. However, the raging seas did not dishearten people of goodwill. It did not stand in the way of their determination to herald the beginning of a new era. The storm provided something of an analogy of the rush of events that would take European and world history onto a new trajectory. Those gale forces of 30 years ago personify the determination of two men who changed the world of their time. Then US President George H.W. Bush and Soviet President Mikhail Gorbachev. Malta closely witnessed this newfound hope and made it its own. We embraced the vision of a world which is more just, safer, and where differences and issues are rather discussed at a table. And together with the rest of the world, we rejoiced. We are very proud today to stand here to commemorate what was achieved in Malta. Malta retains its Euro-Mediterranean vocation as a centerpiece of its international relations. As a member of the European Union, we will continue to ensure that peace and security remain the main focus of international relations. Furthermore, as Malta's election to a non-permanent seat on the United Nations Security Council for the years 2023 2024 approaches, we shall remain focused on promoting the UN Charter's principles of peace and security. It remains our imperative duty and responsibility to act proactively and to secure a better world for generations yet to come.